Okay, this will be an interesting one. I'll be don I'll, I'll probably be donating this one, I think, when I'm finished with it and I get around to it. So I found this item and I washed it, so it should be fit for wearing by someone I'm sure who will appreciate it. I think we're going to keep out the enlargement. We're not going to enlarge this one. Uh, leave those out. So I'm wondering... Hang on, we're not doing a background colour with this one. What am I doing? Fuck you. Silly. We're going to make it negative positive for a change. And the colour adjust. See how we go with this. I think the black is going to stay pretty much the same. And we're going to add just a smidge of contrast or a fair amount, but not too much, hopefully. And this is going to have to be a little bit darker, but not too dark for this one. I'm wondering if we're going to darken it further because it's probably going to look more light in this in negative mode. So let's see how we make this one look. Okay, what is it? It is somebody's scarf I found. So I found it and cleaned it up. Uh, now it's going to be used as a piece of demo. Uh, material. We're going to do something interesting with it. Going to move it, as you probably guessed. See if we can make this black and white break up into nice psychedelic colours. The scanner is kind of squeaky, <laughs> which is annoying. It probably means the machine's going to need to be fixed at some stage, because <laughs> when you get funny sounds like squeaks and and groans and that it's usually a sign that something will go eventually go wrong and that looks shit <laughs> that looks shit it looks absolute el blando shit nice pattern but the color wise it looks shit i can't see any bright colors so i'm really disappointed with this so far so i'm just going to put it back and i'm going to try and change it around i think negative positive does not work with this kind of original, so we're just going to switch it off. I don't know if this one's going to come up a treat or not. I don't know. So we're just going to lighten it off a little bit. And maybe one thing we're going to do that might work is we might resort to enlarging it. So maybe that'll bring up the detail more. So we're going to make it 141.4. And let's see, we're going to work it, make it look really good. Let's see if it works, if we go a bit faster. Let's see how that goes. But well, sometimes with experiments, you've got to expect that occasionally you're going to get failures. <laughs> Not everything works out in the world of copier configuration art. So let's see how it goes. I think most photocopier artists would probably agree that you, you do get failures a lot of the time. But that's part of the experimental nature of this uh, process. Let's see if we've got those bright colours breaking up. Yes, we do have some bright colours here. It's not the greatest, uh, but you can see a little rainbow in amongst the black. And now we, if you want to see it better, we're just going to get close to it. But that looks all right. It's not too bad. We got something out of it, so at least you'll be able to get a good look at these lovely psychedelic colours. Not as psychedelic as I wanted it to be, but it works better in positive than negative.